Let's head back to the voicemail of Truth and Reason. Andrew Barry has done a great job of at least putting the pieces in place to put up an, a winning organization. He's addressed the defensive line. He's addressed, you know, different parts of the organization, wide receiver, kicker, what have you. And I feel that if anything were to change out of this year, it probably would be Kevin Stefanski just because of the fact that the play calling doesn't seem to be relaying the wins that on offense, at least, that we need to have. I think they should definitely never get rid of Andrew Barry, or at least not for the time being, because he's done his job. I just think it's not being followed through with the coaching staff. Scott, you know, that's a tricky thing. You can point to the draft. You can point to, you know, the right now – um, the decision to trade Joshua Dobbs is is kind of a, you know, th that was one that I didn't think matched all of the other moves where you were in win-now mode. Yeah, that's interesting. Um, I'm glad you brought that up because that is, right now, looks like a mark against Andrew Barry, right, when you look at his whole resume, um, that Joshua Dobbs trade. Uh, it's interesting, you know, a lot of time to play out before any of those kind of decisions are made, who stays, who goes, if anybody, if anybody goes. Um but I could see that, you know, what the caller's talking about. Could Andrew Barry stay and Kevin Stefanski go at some point? Yeah, that's um, entirely possible. Um, and it's just interesting how you look at it, right? We just had that Elijah Moore discussion. Okay, well, it sounds like the caller is, put, is pinning that on Kevin Stefanski. Okay, well, Andrew Barry went with, with the guy that went and got him, right? So maybe he doesn't have the requisite skill set to be a every down contributor in this league. We don't know that yet. Um I've defended Jed Wills a bunch, but, you know, a lot of people criticize him. Andrew Barry spent the number 10 pick on the draft, in the draft, on Jedrick Wills Jr., right? Um, and you can do that with every roster transaction. Um, so, you know, I, I do think the roster's plenty talented to win games. I think the coaching staff's good enough to win games. So it does feel like all the parts are here. And if it goes sideways, then, yeah, somebody's going to take the fall, and it would be interesting to see how that plays out.